after the uh, offering of the Anukut, Giriraj Govardhan Maharaj enjoyed the offering of the uh, all of the Prajapasis. And all they returned to their homes. All returned. All returned to their with homes. Krishna. With Krishna. Very happy. Yes. And Krishna told them, Oh, have you seen an Indra even? Never you have seen. So then, Lord Indra, he was observing all of this, and actually he became very disturbed and very upset that he was not being given these sacrificial offerings. So he decided that he was going to retaliate against the bridge bosses. And uh, Indra uh, ordered his very powerful cloud, the Samvarataka cloud, to come, which is generally used at the time of devastation. What he thought? And he became angry. What he told? You know, the cows and the Brahmins and all the residents of Vrindavan. You remember? <coughs> you don't remember what Indra told to Krishna? Have you seen this boy? Where is Mahabharata? He's practicing for a play. What Indra told? No sickness for the recording. Oh, this wicked boy. He is quite ignorant and following his words, all gops and gopis have become bewildered. I will punish them with this war. I will do so much sins that anyone in Prajabhasi, they will not be shaped. So I am telling like this. And he ordered all Sambhartakas. You should rent. You should. But for water, water, water rice, and inundate. So that there should be no any shine of Brajavasis here. No shine. Govardhan should also be smashed into pieces. And this part should be punished so much. And all Brajavasis should put to death. So much water should come there. That everywhere. Only flawed, 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 nothing more. And then? And then the Sambhartaka cloud began to rain down, pouring uh, massive amounts of, of rain water, like oceans of water, down on Giriraj, Govardhan, and uh, on all the bridge buses, and also lightning and thunderbolts. What's our decision? At that time? Sarat. Sarat. It that time very cool in India. So cool and ritu. And thus began so much air. Wind with water and so much cold. And then all began to then the bridge Vasis began to approach Krishna. There was no place to save them. Their houses were ruined. Everything. As much. The pieces. Rainwater, so And like pillars. Like pillars. Like the eggs of elephants. <laughs> And so many thunderbolts. And all Brajvasis, what have the heart happened to him? Only by this innocent boy he told and we followed. Nanda Baba followed and we followed Upananda told. <coughs> so we will have to test the result. They blame, that, eh? they blame Nanda Baba and Krishna. Yes. That, that we have done that. Now where to go, what to do? But there was so much water, they cannot move here and there. And they quickly went to Krishna. If you have done like this, 
they had only obeyed. Then you should tell Govardhan Giriraj that he should set us now. Oh, quickly, Krishna. You should bring your all utensils, everything on bullock cars. Bullock cars should come. With all your kind, all your children, go, gopi, happy. All persons also. And quickly they came, and quickly, in a second, anyone could not see that house. Firstly, Krishna took us on his finger. That became very deep, very, very deep heat. Govardhan was seven miles high and seven miles also. Deep and seven. Fourteen miles. Fourteen miles. Very high. So when he go, that became a very deep, like peat. But no matter. There. If anyone dig only fourteen, fifteen yards down, what a matter? But when he took Govardhan, very easily, like a lotus flower like this, <laughs> nothing. <laughs> and he called all Brajivasi, all cows, <coughs> especially Krishna was at the age of seven. So gopis were not married. No? All gopis, Vrishmana Nandani, Radhayu, Lalite, Vishakha, Chitra, Champaklapa, Tumbhidya, Hindu, they came. All came. And Krishna was taking this. All gopis. The friends became so very. How Krishna alone can bear the weight of this as well? They quickly took their dandas, sticks. Oh, oh, don't worry, my kanaya. Oh, you should take rest, we are taking. <laughs> but Radhike and all other gopis were so much worried. They get their sight under Govardhan. Govardhan, they will punish you. And you should be on our eyes. Don't. Don't have any way down Krishna. So who was lifting that Gora, Giraj Govardhan? Actually, not Krishna. How? Power always becomes in left side. So left hand. And in left side, this, if that is not Krishna. If he has taken Giriraj Govardhan in right, then we should understand that Krishna has taken, lifted Giriraj Govardhan. But Krishna never. Hmm? To show this, he did. And Srimati Radhika. Power is the Radhika. Krishna is not power. So Krishna is manifested with power. He has all powers. So he thought like that, at, at once Srimati Radhika took Govardhan. First Srimati Radhika, what is Govardhan? Whole world, lakhs and lakhs world. On his base she can take. So this is the majestic power of Srimati Radhika. Without Radhika power, Krishna is like zero. Nothing like Nirvishesh Brahma. <laughs> Nothing to do pranam. Who will do pranam? Anyone is not there. Nothing to pranam. So Radhika lifted it. They were first chance. They came together in front of Krishna. This was the main reason that Krishna lifted that all Govardhan Vasi gops will not tell any anything to their daughters. And they will quickly come to me and for seven days we will together. That is why. So first time all the gopis, and a little little Kishori gopi, not Kishori at that time. At this age of six, half, five, like this. Oh. 
Lalita was only at the age of Krishna, and all were some somewhat younger. Days. And all seven days, Indra began to throw hell so much, thunderbolt, and he wanted to peace. Uh, to smash good the Raj into pieces, pieces. But it has been told in prayer. What? Saprista hastam bujasau kamarje sukhanu bhote rati bhumi vritte mahendra bhajra hati mapya janan govardhano me Dishatam abhishtam or Govardhano me Dishatam abhishtam Govardhano me Dishatam abhishtam Govardhano me Dishatam abhishtam Tell you, Rinder, O Giraj Govardhan, when Krishna lifted you on your finger, oh, you became so happy, you were realizing so much happiness, that even Indra was throwing his standard balls <coughs> so much, but what he was thinking? Oh, like that, very happy. Jatraiva ko, Jatraiva Krishna, Vishabhanu putra, Danam grihitam, Kalaham vite, Sute jatra. Mahatta Tahasi Govardhano Me Krishna sometimes used to block their ways where in Dhan Ghati and quarrels between gopis and Krishna. Krishna wanted that you should give some tax here. And they used to tell that uh, why tax? Oh, this place is mine. Then gopis and especially Lalita used to tell, is this property of your father or grandfather or grand grandfather? From where you collected? So this is not your property. Oh, this is my property. How this is your property? Because this all property is of Vrindavan and she is my wife. <laughs> oh, they began to clap that you are so liar. And cheater, Brinda cannot marry you because you are black. In Braja, any, any girls does not want or any parents to give you marriage their daughters. So now you are thinking that all girls are my wife. So Brinda, you think that he is your wife. We are calling just now. They called Brinda. In front of Krishna and all gopis were there. They asked Vrinda, Oh, have you married this black person, black boy? No, no, I don't know him. Who is he? <laughs> never, never, I cannot do a mistake like this. She is like, uh, she wants that, uh, tells that all are my wives here, but no one wants to marry her. So I am not his wife. Then they began to plan. Oh. But Krishna was so uh, clever. Clever. Tricky. Tricky and clever. No, no, no. Really, she is my wife. And this is my property, you will have to give. Then they get some paid lot, little curd, makkhan, and everything to Krishna. One day, like this. Oh, Krishna used to do daily like this. We should give a lesson to him. One day they caught all Vilta Vishakha. First they catch hold of Madhumangal. And this tricky was tightened in, in the trees, branches. And all. And they began to do. <laughs> all were so much afraid. They told that you should promise that never we will do like that. 
But one word told that uh, I am promising I will never, I, I, I will have no friendship with that black person. <laughs> and thus, thus, all the gopis go Krishna and possibly they put a langa to Krishna and Chundari from out this deer. And his cuts hairs were so, so they do like choti, and gave yashandu, and like a lady, and they gave some vessels of pots of yogurt, yogurt. yogurt. and Lalita gave him. <laughs> and Krishna covered, was covered with took bath with yogurt, and all gopis went like <laughs> I will not do. Then you should beg pardon in the lotus feet of Srimati Radhika. Then Krishna did. Oh, Radhika, you should forgive me. So, this is in Govardhan. Govardhan is Shakhi. Evidence. Evidence. So, Govardhan should be placed to us. That we can realize this. Very free master himself. Go, go, be. Gahi Govasan, everything. I think Govardhan is here or praying <coughs> and he is sprinkled. After seven days, Indra becomes soft. Go, anyone, and see that there are there any anyone saved from this? He went there and saw. Uh, what? Elephant? Hairavat came. And he saw that, uh, oh, all are saved. Not a single leaf also dropped from him. Not a, even a leaf of tree has been dropped from his tree, branch. And he went to Indra and told that, oh, brother, all are so happy. No, anything is not damaged. Then he thought that, who is he? Actually, he is Brahma, our Lord. Then he knew that, oh, he is certainly our Lord. Then he went to Surabhi. We have done puja to that Surabhi. The mother of all cows. Where? Not on Golo Vrindavan. Some manifestation of that, that Surabhi in this world. In Golo. One Golok there, one Lok here. Like one Vrindavan here, like Vrindavan there. And the Indra began to apologize and tell that, Oh Mother, check me. Otherwise Krishna will ruin us. You should come with me and um, Krishna ko prasanna ko. Please Krishna. Then she came and water from, get this water from there. So much milk and ghee and everything, what we did of shake here, she came and she came to Krishna. Oh Krishna, oh Indri is my like son. So you should forgive. For sake of, to please Surabhi, Krishna. Somewhat not uh, wanting but even he forgave. And Indra kept Krishna name. Govinda. Govinda Deva Ki Jai. I am not Govinda. I am not Govardhan. I have no connection with these cows. I have false ego that I am Lord of all. But actually, Giriraj Govardhan, Krishna is. Gopal is everything. He is supreme person of the world. So he is Govinda. He uh, supports and nourishes all Gop, Gopi, Gabi, Gobatsa and all Gopi Mandal, Golok. And, and after that, they return to their places. Go! It may be that Indra began to, um, Shankar. Prayed to Chakra that you should save, otherwise all go, go be 
then everything will be finished. So chakra came, and seeing chakra on the seventh day, on the moment, oh, in the quickly he ran away from there. And oh, chakra, then he may be that Narayan or more than that. Yes. Drama is ready. What is the time now? <laughs> oh, then second time drama should be done. And from today again, I may speak on Srimad I wanted to do more. But any, anyhow, it was so. Okay, if anyone has come here, join this, and he has participated anyway. Giraj Govardhan will be so merciful. To the temple, the jugal love and affection of the Any people? And you should try to. Oh, Matukiya? You have traversed the path of saints and sages And kindly taken me along And though I am a deaf man Sometimes I can hear their song Chaitanya was sitting in the midst of his bhaktas. Haridas, you are my dear most servitors. 
I have a request of you. Go to every man in the town. Walk from door to door and tell them about Sri Krishna, who is the life of everyone. Please, don't distinguish between the rich, the poor, the ignorant or the foolish, high or low, or Brahmin or Sudra. I want you to go and save them all. Am incomparably pious, and they had acquired the power of imparting the Holy Spirit. Nittai and Haridas exposed upon them was to start early in the morning to travel from door to door, deliver the message, and then return at home at noon. In Nadia, the simple message proclaimed by Haridas and Nittai produced wonderful effects. Most men accepted, and it was because they were backed by the force which Messiahs carry with them. profound pity. His notion was that Jagai and Madai, in spite of their worldly prosperity, were the most miserable of sinners. For Nittai, the afterworld and the suffering of sinners, there were a stern reality. He knew that the brothers would suffer terribly hereafter. The condition of these two brothers, therefore, called for his earnest consideration. But he was further helped in his deep resolution of converting the brothers by motives of policy. Namely, in order that these two men, so well known in the country and so dreaded by the people, might bear witness to the reality of the avatar Sri Gauranga. No, honey, that's barely got away that time. <laughs> My dear Hari Das, I have one request for you. I want you to go to Mahaprabhu and ask him that the brothers deserve his first consideration. Tell him if he has pity on those two fools, then they can be saved. Please tell the Lord for me. <laughs> his theatrical group was singing about. The Lord ignored...
but I grant over to him all the pious merit that I may have obtained through all the good acts that I have performed throughout the entire course of my whole existence. <laughs> Of smoking, drinking, you should give up. Come today. Then surely the mercy of Nityananda Prabhu and Haridas Thakur will come, and by their mercies, Nityananda Prabhu will be there. Nimai, that is Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, will be very merciful to you. If anyone is doing Offenses to the lotus feet of devotees, Mahaprabhu cannot do anything. But if Haridas Thakur will be so pleased and he will request Nityananda Prabhu, and then Nityananda Prabhu will be mercifully and when Chaitanya Mahaprabhu will know the will of Nityananda Prabhu, all will be. Absolute and all had Krishna in. So I am requesting all those who are not following all these principles, you yes, should try to very strongly don't take my. I have heard from the body, so many disciples of Swamiji lacking of association. association. Now they are returning to the same point. Now they are taking drops, wines, becoming more lusty, and so many bad qualities in them. So, I come ordered by Swamiji, Bhaktivedanta Swamiji, to remind you all. And this play, not play, only to remind you all. Especially those who are playing this drama from today. Be pure as Nityananda Prabhu wanted. Then, if any effect will come, if anyone teaching anything to devotees, but if he is not pure, not qualified, his teachings will be very. Huh? No effect. It may be for temporary effects. So the gurus who are not qualified to teach, and if they are teaching anything, don't take wine, don't take drugs, don't cheat anyone. They can listen for a moment, momentary results. But if you will be like that, yourself, not taking wine, no anything, no smoking, no drugs, no yajalasam, then all the devotees will bound to follow this. So my request is that we should again come in the same uh, time eh? as Swamiji came here. You should think that Swamiji is here. And you should again be inspired like the same time. <coughs> so he has sent me to see, or they are following me or not. So when I will return, what I will tell? <laughs> so if you are promising like that, then I will go and meet him and tell, Oh, I am happy, I am satisfied, all are following you. And always remembering 
always keeping you in your heart and your words. Gaur Prama.